This is the Nebraska Tractor Testing Laboratory. The testing laboratory was opened in 1919. In the early days of tractors, farmers ran into issues of tractors not performing as well as manufacturers claimed they would. So the Nebraska legislation passed the law stating every tractor sold in Nebraska must be performance tested. Dr. Roger Hoy explains why the Nebraska government believed the testing center was a necessity. At that time, there was a lot of different tractor manufacturers, and some of them were reputable and some weren't. So I think the real attempt of the law was to try to get the non-reputable manufacturers prevented from selling tractors in Nebraska. Normally, we start off with the tractor doing a power takeoff test. And tractors deliver power through a rotary coupling at the back of the tractor known as a power takeoff. So during that test, we measure how much torque or how much twisting action the tractor can produce with that connection and also how fast and rotary speed the connection can turn. And if you multiply the speed times the torque, you get the power that's being delivered. Also during this test, we measure the amount of fuel the tractor uses, so we can include that in our test reports. Second test we do is drawbar testing, where we see how hard the tractor can pull and how fast it can go. So we do that out on our test track, and we have a machine we call our load car that we can attach to the back of the tractor that it can pull us. And we measure the force it can deliver, and we measure the travel speed, as I mentioned, and again, we measure how much fuel is used, so farmers can know something about the fuel economy as well as the pulling abilities of the tractor. The third test we do is for hydraulic power, and most tractors today have hydraulic a hydraulic pump that can supply fluid to implements for working hydraulic cylinders or even some hydraulic motors. So we measure the pressure that system can develop and what flow rate, in other words, how much fluid per minute can flow. And if you multiply the two of those together, you get power as well. The fourth test we do is to see how much the three-point lift on the back of the tractor can pick up. And this is just a measurement of force. So some implements are attached with a three-point hitch, and we just document how much force can be exerted by the tractor. And the last test we do is just about sound. We like to know how loud it is for a tractor operator to drive the tractor, and we also like to know how much noise is created uh, for bystanders that might be nearby that they're exposed to. The testing center is not only a job, but a fun experience for all who are involved. Dr. Hoy and two students tell us what they enjoy most about their work in the testing center. The initial attraction was getting to get up close, really, with all the latest model tractors from all the manufacturers. Uh, but what I've really discovered since being here is what I have the most enjoyment out of is really working with the undergraduate students and really helping them develop into engineers, being a, being a role model, being a mentor for them. I like a uh when we're not testing, we're doing like fabrication projects, stuff like that, so I, I enjoy that. I'd say it's actually working with the tractors, actually getting hands-on testing experience with the tractors that are currently in design and in production. It's a lot more fun when they actually have some problems because then you get to see the actual engineers uh, come in and fix their problems, you know, so it's, it's pretty cool. Even the tractor company representatives enjoy their time in Nebraska. Absolutely, yes. It, it doesn't get any better than this. It's, um, there's a lot of fulfillment working with the finished product, uh, brand new equipment, um, seeing a tractor do what it's designed to do. Uh, this is really where, where the rubber meets the road, literally. Uh, we operate tractors as they're meant to operate. Agriculture is the number one industry in Nebraska. In order for that industry to continue to thrive, farmers need to be able to depend on their tractors and what the salesmen tell them. This is why the Nebraska Tractor Testing Laboratory is so important. Farmers do not have the time to worry about if their tractor will have the power that manufacturers claim. The experts at the lab put those worries to rest so farmers can continue to focus on producing food for you and me.